So this is one of the most advanced acoustic guitars on the planet. Is this the future of acoustic instruments? Is this an acoustic revolution? Well, let's find out. Yeah, so as I mentioned, we've got a super advanced acoustic guitar in the studio. This is from Lag Guitars and it features the high vibe system, basically billed as the world's first smart guitar. So let's take a closer look. Now, what exactly makes this guitar a smart guitar? Well, according to these guys, you don't have to plug this thing in ever. Not into an amp, not into a pedal board, not into an outboard effects unit, not into a looper. It's all built into this guitar without having to plug it in. It's really trippy the first time, you know, you hear some chorus or delay or verb come straight out of the sound hole without being plugged in. You can use this guitar anywhere and have all those effects or using the looper and then soloing over it and hearing both guitars coming out of the sound hole at the same time, really crazy stuff. I mean, this guitar even has a USB-C here for charging or updating the firmware on your acoustic guitar. Now that is not a phrase I ever imagined myself saying, ever. Just give me a second, I'm updating the firmware on my acoustic. So, that being said, let's try this thing out. All right, you guys, so let's go through some of the effects that are available on this guitar. Gotta reiterate, I'm not plugged in at all. Everything you're hearing is coming straight from the sound hole of this guitar, picked up by my mic here. So effect number one is verb, let's try that out. Let's turn that off. Back on. Now you have a couple parameters. You've got a mix. So if you don't want so much verb, you can just kind of dial that back and have, you know, more of your just straight guitar coming through. And you've also got a slider. So if you want short decay, just put it down, long decay up. So here's short decay. Long decay. So there's a pretty wide variety of, uh, you know, sounds you can get for each effect. And it's really easy. Like, you know, some people are like, I don't want anything to do with like, you know, technology or whatever. Uh, it's just a, literally a mix knob and your parameter if you want less or more. And that's it. Then you've just got to up, down and enter. So let's just hit up, go to the next one. This is chorus. <laughs> <laughs> That's on the maximum depth. You can really hear the, you know, the waveform going there. Some good warble. Let's take it to the shallowest setting here. And of course, we still have our mix knob. So if we want to dial it like maybe half and half, it can even be more subtle. You know, so more natural sounding. Let's go to the next one. Oh, echo. Okay, here we go. So here the slider uh, controls the time. So if you want short delay, long delay, and of course, still the mix, how much you want in there. So let's try that out. Crazy. You can hear, you can feel like the top vibrating with the, the with the delays. And that's awesome. Awesome. Next one. Oh, phaser. Let's crank that one up as well. Go a little more subtle on that one. Next up. Oh, trim. Here we go. Go deep on that one. Let's 
slow that down a bit. Sounds great. Octave. Okay, so when the slider's down, we're going to go an octave down. When it's up, an octave up. Let's crank the mix there again. Let's go octave up. Maybe take the mix down slightly on that one. That's pretty brash. <laughs> Super fun. Oh, distortion. Okay, so let's try this out. <laughs> can kind of control the the feedback. <laughs> Just by controlling the waveforms or the the sound sound waves with your hand. Not sure how much I'd use that one, but that's kind of like the basic effects. You can also uh, uh, Bluetooth your phone if you don't for some reason want to use these controls, you can control everything uh, with your phone if you Bluetooth it as well. All right, you guys, now it's time for my all-time favorite feature on this guitar, and that is the looper. You can do four bar loops, eight bar loops, 16 bar loops, change the tempo, you can change what effects you want. So on my rhythm track, I've chosen verb. And then for my solo, I have delay. So you can have two different effects going while the loop's kind of jamming. Very cool stuff. You just hit record, gives you four kind of beat count in on the metronome, and then you're off to the races. So let's try this thing out. And then you can use the mix knob on the top to kind of mix in how much, you know, rhythm track you want versus how much, um, you know, your soloing track is. So I'm going to dial it back in and I'm just kind of j jam over top of this track. Great tool. I mean, you can use whatever style you want um, and just practice soloing. Awesome. I mean, I can do that kind of stuff for hours and the ability just to grab your guitar, do it, you know, on your back deck, take it to your buddy's place, whatever. You can have all those effects going on um, wherever you take your guitar. Another great feature is the built-in metronome. You can choose your time signature, your beats per minute, all that kind of stuff. Great for, you know, doing exercises, warm-ups. Here's what that sounds like. So on and so forth so it's really handy to have right on your guitar you never have an excuse for you know leaving your phone or something else behind it's always with you and uh yeah great for practicing
Now obviously it's the smart features that make this guitar what it is, but moving past that, this is just a nice acoustic. It's a dreadnought shape, and even without any of the effects, it's got a big, bold sound. So solid spruce on the top, mahogany on the sides, mahogany on the back, kind of a satin finish here. Um, I've got to say the grain is quite wonderful as well. It looks really nice. And on the front face, it's kind of rolled all the way around the edges. I'll take a shot for you guys so you can see what I mean. But yeah, just kind of really nice rolled uh, front face. Very simple line along the perimeter, but when you look at the rosette or you look at the headstock, you know it's more than just your typical you know acoustic even the tuning machines look a little different and pretty cool so that's kind of just a brief overview of the guitar itself so this model here is the thv 10 dce i will link to it in the video description below it's kind of the entry level into the high vibe line retails for about a thousand bucks so Hope you guys enjoyed this demo. It's always interesting to see what manufacturers are doing to kind of take guitars and instruments up to the next level, adding more value, all that kind of stuff. Very cool. Have yourself a great day.